Hey y'all, uh, Bob Brenneman back with you uh, again today and we're covering a new neighborhood in what is not really Mount Pleasant but is, is tied very closely to Mount Pleasant, uh, a town called Allendahl. And Allendahl is located, uh, again, uh, north of Mount Pleasant. Uh, you have access to Mount Pleasant through Allendahl. And it's, it's rural but it's being rapidly developed and the neighborhood we're profiling today is Allendahl Village. It's being built by Klein Homes, which many of y'all know that if you've ever talked to me or you know watched some of my other videos, I'm a big fan of what Klein does. I think they, they build great houses and I personally would, would buy one of their houses in a heartbeat. So I uh, definitely recommend this, them as builders. It's being built, uh, again, like I said, um, in Allendahl, which was named after, I did a little history stuff, and you can read more if you want to learn more of the history, but I, I always think to throw some of that in. It's cool when you're talking about Charleston. Uh, so it was named after the Siwi Native American Indians. It was first settled in 1696, so it's a very old settlement. And uh, like I said, if you're history buffs, I recommend that you read about the history of Allendahl because it's, it's, it's some interesting reading. Uh, Allendahl Village, you know, combines the amenities of suburban living uh, with a rural feel, basically. Brand new houses, they're situated on about uh, 100 acres of land. So it's a lot of land for 41 total houses is the plan to build. Uh, the lots range from half an acre all the way uh, to, uh, you know, 0.8 or so. And they all back up to protected woodlands uh, that would never be developed. At least that's what I'm told at cutting of this video. Home prices or home, home sizes range from the 2,500 uh, square foot range on up to about 4,000 square feet. And prices range from the 600s on up to the mid sevens just probably depending on when you get in uh, is, is the, the, the price point. Some of the houses have master down, which, uh, you know, if you've ever watched my videos or talked to me in person, you know I'm a big fan of buying a master down because I always think exit strategy with real estate and it's going to be easier long term to resell a house with a master down. So I think that's important and you may need it at some point. The number of bedrooms, three to four bedrooms, so kind of standard, you know, two and a half, three and a half baths. 10 foot ceilings on the main floor, nine foot on the uh, on the second floor. Coffered ceilings, uh, you've got some shiplap, you've got good, you know, good built-ins, nice high-end kitchens. And I think, you know, honestly, for the money, it's, it's, it's a pretty good value. It is a little further out. So I think that's the one thing you have to factor in if you're considering all in all village is the amount of time that it could take you uh, to get to and from your job. But if you're, uh, if you're living in Mount Pleasant, your kids are going to school in Mount Pleasant, or you're retired in Mount Pleasant, uh, I think it's, it's a good alternative uh, to being you know, in some of these uh, more tight neighborhoods as far as houses next to you. Phase one is going to have about 14 home sites uh, and all of those will have views of the Village Pond, which I believe you all probably seen as I've done this video. The other phase is going to be built after they get the 14 home sites and homes sold. So the long term of it I think is really good. Uh, one thing to keep in mind if you have kids that are school age and you're considering all and all village is the elementary and the grade school are St. James and St. James is, I'll let you do your research on it, but it's not the Mount Pleasant schools. For high school, you do get access to Wando High School, which is typically in the top 15, 20 high schools in the uh, public high schools in the United States year in and year out. Again, I'm Bob Renneman. I am a longtime resident of this area, and I love to talk about Charleston or anything related to this area, uh, whether it be restaurants, schools, things to do when you come on vacation, for that matter. You can call me at 843-345-6074, and you can always check out our website, which is devoted to Mount Pleasant, uh, all in all sister city, which is mountpleasantproperty.net. And our main website for all of Charleston is BrennemanGroup.com. If you like our videos, make sure you hit the subscribe button down in the right-hand corner of your screen. We'd love for you to join us on YouTube on a regular basis. And again, call me anytime. Hope you all have a great week, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye, y'all.